everybody, how are you? Okay, we're still in this uh, kind of a list of uh, props and designs, okay? So, oh, this one, you're gonna love it. And I think, it, I'm happy with uh, this design. It's hard to play, you know, with characters, a specific character because the colors, right? And then play with the balloons and sometimes you don't have all the balloons. So I'm gonna show you my first try. Who is this guy? I forgot the name, but it's kind of like a reindeer or what's the name of this animal from Frozen? Um, Evans? No, Vance? Evan? Evan? Well, I forgot. I'm gonna <laughs> put it right now. Beep, beep, beep. Okay. So, um, so this is what it came out the first time. And look, I used that picture. So that picture was kind of the, the good model, you know, to make this a sign. And look at this. I love it. I love it. But I wasn't happy with the colors. So I decided to play with these other colors and make some, um, you know, like uh, fixing some things and, you know, update it. And this is what it came out. So let's start. For this design, you're going to use a total of these balloons. But this is a good thing. I'm thinking if you only make the head, then with this white uh, 160 balloon, you can make like a one. So it can be, you know, if you don't have time, like a one of this animal. Benz, I forgot the name. <sighs> <laughs> okay, I have it, but I forgot. Mm. Okay, so then you can be a one. So then you have to, uh, you can avoid this uh, part. But the good thing is, like the same balloon I use for this part, I use it for the shoes, right? And this uh, balloon is all, you know, one balloon. So uh, let's see. Let's start with the brown. So um, what do you think if we, um, I move here, so you can see all the time that design there. Okay, so let's start with a 260 uh, brown inflated, like probably eight finger tail. And what you're gonna do is the legs. So it's like you measure four or five finger bubble, another four or five finger bubble. And then you don't make any pinch twist here. Just leave it there. Then you measure like five or six finger bubble. And then you make four or five finger bubble here. Exactly, I don't know. I just, you know, like, like this. So it's kind of like four, but a little leg. So it's five, huh? <laughs> Oh my goodness. Okay, so what I'm doing here is now the booty. So this is the kind of the regular body, basic body that I do for the fox, for the wolf. And if you don't know what I'm talking about, check out my playlist of animals, balloon animals, because I have a lot of cool designs like the, the fox, the, what is this, corgi doggies. And um, yeah, okay. So um, we have this. So we go back and we go back. So this is the thing, I was thinking the first time, oh, with two pinch trees for the booty, you know, it's gonna be okay. But, you know, I thought, what happened if I add another one? So I'm gonna add another pinch trees, and look at this. It's even better, I think, because you have this little extra thing, and you can leave that for the tail. I just make it like a shape like this. And I like it, I like it. <laughs> That's too much, too much. Okay, so this is the first part. Now we're going with the second part that is gonna be the head. In between is gonna be that neck that is all white, so we're gonna use the 160 white. So but let's go with this brown 260 first. Inflate it again, a finger tap probably it's gonna be enough. So um well we're gonna start and all the bubbles trying to make it very soft. You will see why I'm saying that. Okay, so I'm making like a loop soft like three finger bubble, another soft three finger bubble, and then I'm going with a soft four finger bubble, go back four finger bubble, and then here another four finger bubble, and I do this like the rose, rose technique, roll it, and make a very soft, even softer, like this bubble, how it's like three finger loop, I mean, I squish again a three finger loop, and now, pass this through a couple of times, like this, and go back, four finger bubble. Okie dokie, so now you have that. You can read, already get rid of this piece. Yeah, so I cut, I always leave a little, and this I save them for, you know, the, the bubble gum machines, right? The gumbo machines, bubble gum. Gumbo machines, okie dokie. Those are awesome to make and do up. Everybody loves those, uh, that design, right? Okay, so you have this. Hmm. Okay, now, what else? It's part, like, kind of connected. But let's wait. Let's keep going with the head. So you can see, now you're going to grab your uh, balloon 260. And what is that color? Is that dark chocolate, you know? It's a chocolate brown. So inflated, how long? Like, six-finger tail. Okay, now, let's keep going. Oh, my neighbors are...
really is running the bus. What? I don't know. I'm sorry. I was saying. <laughs> my son was like, I was checking the, the message. Okay, okay. <laughs> that face, I was probably too silly. Okay. Uh, let's keep going. So, this is what I did. Look. I made like a bubble, like a four finger bubble. And this is going to be a big pinch twist. So, that's going to be kind of like the nose. And then from here, I did a little loop, just like two and a half finger loop. And then from here, I'm gonna make one little bubble. You see, little bubble. And I'm gonna touch it right here, right there. Yep, in between the cheeks. And then I put everything here. And look, this is a cool thing, cool technique, I guess. Another new technique, I don't know. But you're gonna squeeze this, make it soft uh, and squishable, and also because it, it's better, I think it looks skinnier. So, and then you pass it through here. So, you see, in between this pinch twist and this little loop, you pass it in between, and you go back to the between of these two cheeks. Okay? And when you have done, now you can get rid of this. No, well, cut it, but save this because those are gonna be the horse shoes, but no, it's the winter shoes, right? Or what animal is that? It's like an elk, yeah? Um, I don't know. Um, but it, this could be a good design also for Christmas, right? The same technique that's, because I think it's a really cool one. So look, you have this. Okie dokie. Now with this, we're going to start making the shoes. How I made it? It's like two finger bubble, another two finger bubble. And twist it together and you do the double pinch twist. Yep. Leave some space to connect it to the legs, and you go ahead and repeat. Do -do 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 -do. I'm always in a hurry. You know why I have to go pick up my kids? Today is every release. It's like, oh my goodness. So, but I have the idea. I made the design and thinking, wow, I have to share this with you as soon as possible. So, uh, let's keep going. So, you see, this is the body. Let's attach the shoes, and I just go and attach them. You see, and then this one to this side. Okay, okay. So so far, we cannot make things separated, but it's okay because that's the idea. You see, you have this part, you have that part. Keep going with the head. Now we should start making this the horns. <laughs> so what I did is I make a bubble, like two finger bubble, another two finger bubble, or three finger bubble, and twist it together and pass this through. So it's locked. And then I'm gonna measure um, here like a three or four finger bubble, very tight, three and a half, I guess. <laughs> another like two and a half finger bubble, another two and a half finger bubble, and pass this through. You see? And then you pass it through here. Up, 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 up. Bam. Okay, then you make another three and a half or four finger bubble, and you're gonna touch it right here. Go ahead, do it. And when you have that, now it's time to do this trick. That's what I told you. Make soft, squishy bubbles all this part. Because look, this uh, little loops, you're going to put it in between. So you open this part and put it in between. All the way inside. And that same, the other side. You grab it and squeeze it and touch it down. Yeah. What do you think about this idea? Why not, right? Anything is possible. So that's going to be kind of the idea of ears coming a little bit up, down. And then from here, I'm going to make two pinch twists. Very soft. It's going to be easy if you make it soft. And that's going to kind of make the um, horns or antlers. Antlers, that's the word, right? Um, kind of cool to stay and play with how, you know, like the shape you want that. So you do now go back and do the same. Four and three, blah, blah, blah. And two, 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 two. Pass this through because if you don't pass this through here, it's not going to be locked and it may pass. Yep, it may I mean, get a twist with, when you give it to the kid, and that's gonna be like, ah, oh, man, to fix it, it's always harder. So I'm just doing the same what I did the other side. You keep it, save it, but you're not gonna use it for this design anymore. Okay, now to pass it through so it's locked. You can cut these things later to make it look, you know, like, I don't know, clean of those things. So you can play with this, how you know you want it, these things, but I'm gonna leave it like this. Okay, so we have all that. Ooh, looking good. Looking good. Yeah. Now, 160, the last balloon to use. Yep. You're going to make first what I like uh, to do. Okay, let's connect these things together. But this is the idea. 
Uh, if you, you know, thinking, oh, you know what, uh, I'm gonna make it into a one because it already took this too long. So you just go ahead and make the one, you know, connect it to the here, and then go in a spiral, and then with a little, save a little extra for that front tip, okay? And I'm gonna show you how I'm talking when I'm talking for the front tip. But right now, we're gonna make it that kind of more classic way, the whole body, if, because that will be ideal if you have that time. So from here, you touch it right there, and you're gonna measure like four finger bubble, or five, what well, you can see that. And then you're gonna connect it right here. Okay, so from here, you twist it a couple times and make three little loops. Yep, three little loops. When I say three little loops, like one and a half finger loops. Okay, that's gonna give that sensation of puffiness for that mane or what is the, the, the hair. And then you go back, go back with the same measure. And then one more time, you go down. You're gonna have enough balloon, you see, for this. But that's it. So you go um, from here, down, up, and down. Now we're down, we cut this, and this you just save it because that's gonna be the front tip. And now you know that this size looks cuter with those front tip, like the same with all that, right? So it's kind of the same idea. It's kind of the same idea. So look how it's looking so far. I think it's a really awesome, cute design for, uh, you know, like that animal that is the what? What is the animal? <laughs> Me. Oh my goodness, I'm an ignorant. Yep, I know. Okay, let's go with this. Yeah, because even in Spanish, I'm not sure what it is, un venado, un deer, um, but even bigger, right? Uh, something there. Okay, you, what I did is just with the rest of the 160, just like one and a half thing, bubble or one bubble, one bubble, twist it together, leave some extra little piece here and attach it through here. You see, pin, and then it's gonna be twisted with a big pinch twist. And guys, thank you again so much with all your comments. You know, the comments I, I receive are really, uh, I don't know, make me feel so good and uh, I feel very inspired. So thank you, thank you so much. Like motivated, yeah, that's the word, very motivated. And yeah, thank you for your good vibes, your good comments. And and then look at this, wow. Yeah, uh, <laughs> it's awesome. And now, Sharpie time, look what I did here. Um, yeah, if you like this, so keep watching this video because that's what we're gonna do now. If uh, you think you can make it better, go ahead. Because I'm sure we're gonna make it better. I'm gonna take this time that things put it out so you can hear better. Okay, so what I did here, let me remember, I just make here a circle, another circle, okay? And then I leave some space here, as much as you want, but it's gonna be big, big eyebrow, you see? And then the other side too. Oh, I'm so dumb, you're not watching, I'm sorry guys. Okay, so I make a circle, and then another circle, and then I just go, you see what I'm doing? You know it's hard to do this, but uh, it will be easy for you because you're gonna have that thing, you know, in front of you. So here is a little bit harder because I'm like, uh, okay, doing some contortions here, but you can see it. Now, that's all black, yep, I guess. Now let's go with brown. So you just grab brown and look, if you think, oh, this is taking forever, that's too simple, just two black dots. And you know, and you can still add in some more if you want, some more details, like some brown around. And just, that's it, leave it there. But if you still have time, you think, you know, ah, oh, let's make it better. Grab your white Sharpie. And then pass this again. So it's just like a um, rainbow, you know. That one is not working. Yeah. So you just uh, pass this. And, do -do, do -do, uh, and you, that's your decision to, see how long you want this or how thick this white line like this like what is an arch you see and then the last one in between that you the space that you leave there it's gonna be for uh this light blue or blue or purple whatever you have and you just play there mm -hmm. okay and the same the other side I think um, you're gonna love this. I, I love it. I love this design. I'm 
sometimes i don't know exactly how you know the ideas come but i feel very motivated um but i have to confess i don't know what to do the next video i don't know what's going to be the next video i think this is going to be the last um what is mm, balloon figurine from frozen to you know the frozen designs because i don't know much of the characters and um i haven't seen the movie it's not ready yet november 22nd is and i don't even know if i'm gonna go to the movies and watch that you know yeah okay so look this is another extra detail you can do this with sharpie because they this is specific character have those things you know like but um if you think oh because it takes longer sharpie for me at least takes long you can go ahead and grab a purple balloon and maybe you can play with uh, 160 because that it's easy it's longer for some reason hmm. it's just and then you just pass it through you know and, and play with it maybe you go ahead and start here and pass it through here and then just um leave it here and that's it a couple times and and that's it because some things are just more symbolic right and that's an idea you tell me and uh what do you think maybe you can pl play with this and pass it through here i don't know but um it's up to you okay okay <laughs> thank you so much for watching this video for watching all the, the videos i already have more than 200 videos what oh well, i'm i don't know but i have a lot of videos you go ahead check out my, all my playlists or my videos uh, i have even sports playlists i have cartoons and and a lot of things okay i have to go now but um you know i've been thinking something like look what about each video i post with a balloon design um the first comment the first suggestion you know the first person that comment and say and request a figurine you know of something um uh, start with easy things <laughs> and i think that i haven't made yet um i'm gonna do it for the next you know video because i don't know what to do now and um yeah and maybe that can help but Let's see, it's gonna be like a game. Hmm. Okay, have a wonderful day. Bye bye. Would you stop and fall?